Joint stiffness is pretty broad of an issue, but it affects a lot of people. Broad lack of flexibility in a joint. You have trouble moving through any kind of motion smoothly. Um, it feels very tight. It could um, be a result of something like arthritis. It could be a decrease in your joint space, um, either a thinning of a cartilage around a, a bone. Um, it could be a decreased height of a meniscus in per se like your knee. It could be decreased disc space in your spine and it could be um, decreased or degeneration of your labrum in your hip or your shoulder. So when there's decreased joint space and there's not any of that cushioning that I just discussed with you, the bones kind of get closer together and they may rub and that may cause some stiffness um, amongst other things, um, crepitus, um, which is that funky noise you might hear in a joint that doesn't necessarily mean it's painful, but you can hear it. Sometimes there's an increased fluid in the space just due to inflammation in the joint space. Um, some people even have it post-surgery, like if you're coming to therapy after a surgery, like a knee replacement or a hip replacement, um, there's active inflammation, which isn't necessarily a bad thing. There's, it's a good thing, but the problem is with all that swelling in there, the joint is kind of tighter, so it's harder to move throughout a certain range of motion. Um, and as the swelling goes down, then the stiffness kind of relieves itself a little bit, and then you're able to move a little bit better. What can you do or notice during the day that would give you the idea that maybe you have some joint stiffness. Feeling tight in general, slow to move, it takes a little bit of time to get moving in the morning is a big one. Increased difficulty with your normal daily activities. Um, no matter what age you are, if you have trouble getting in a bed, trouble getting out of a chair, going up and down stairs, that's a pretty big deal for most people. So if you notice that that's getting significantly more troublesome for you, then that's something you should take note of. Is it in one joint or is it in multiple joints? could be multiple joints on one side of your body or it could be even multiple joints throughout your body, upper, you know, in your arms or your legs. So take note of that as well. The redness and swelling. Is it happening more frequently now over time? Is it just random? Is it not as frequent um, as you think and then it's manageable, more manageable that way? Take kind of note of how often your, your joint actually feels like that. And whether your stiffness improves pretty quickly or lasts over hours. So how physical therapy can help? How can we do that for you? We can determine the root cause. So even if we see patients who haven't seen a physician, we're highly trained to be able to determine if it's something that we can take care of for you. So the stiffness, is it because of arthritis, do we think? We can do specific tests and measures to determine that in the office without a problem. We would give you individualized exercise program. We would look at you, assess where your issues are at, whether it's range of motion only, range of motion and strength. We incorporate exercises for, so we can do that for you. The biggest thing is the manual treatment. You can't really do that to yourself at home. So we can assess what kinds of things hands-on that we need to address, whether it's helping with the swelling, which we do some retrograde massage for, um, modalities such as ice and or heat, depending on you know how you're presenting, joint mobility. So that means we're moving the joint in a specific way to increase a specific motion. Um, and also just soft tissue work on some of the muscles because sometimes even though the joint's stiff, your muscles around the joint kind of get overworked and we kind of need to address that as well. We spend a lot of time with you and we go over the root causes, we describe the anatomy in ways that you can understand. We can help you prevent the problem from getting worse. We can improve that joint stability. We can give you the proper progression of exercises. And the biggest thing is the patient's goal. So what are you want to return to? Whether you're younger and you play sports or you're older and you just want to be able to walk around your house or walk down the street to get your mail out of the mailbox. We can help you with those things and get you back to doing those things. So if you'd like some more information about joint stiffness or you think you may have an issue with joint stiffness and it's getting worse, just go to the office for more information or click the link below.